Hi! So I'm finally back with a new video and today I'll be showing you what is in my bag! So it has been like how many years? I think about two years that I haven't done like a what's in my bag video since some of you have been requesting for an updated what's in my bag. I'll be showing you what I have. <laughs> this is the bag that I use very regularly. It's actually very small but because I'm so small it looks very big. <laughs> This is from Saint Laurent and I bought it when I was in Paris. It is a very very like huge investment for me because I haven't like I haven't bought a bag that's like so expensive before. So this is the most expensive bag. I contemplated for super long before I buy this because it hurts my heart. Because I've been eyeing for this since I was in Singapore for a few years already and I just couldn't bear to buy it. So when I was in Paris, I went in to take a look again and then after that, this guy was like, you need a little black bag in your life, my dear. I do, I do. <laughs> but anyway, what sold me was that he told me if I buy it in Paris, it's gonna be cheaper obviously than in Singapore. And also, the locket here, he actually like managed to engrave my initials on it, which makes it super personalized. Okay, let's stop talking about the bag. It's like super long and jaggy. So let's just move on to what's inside my bag. Okay, first off, we have my phone. I'm still using iPhone 7 and I'm looking to upgrade to an iPhone 10 soon. But I'm waiting for my contract to end and it's so burdensome. This is my phone case and I love that it's black and it's so sleek and stuff. So the next stuff in my bag is ta -da! portable charger. I haven't changed my portable charger yet if you realize from my past videos. And what's missing is my alpaca sticker because it keeps dropping out. And I don't want to waste my alpaca sticker anymore, they are running out. But yeah, this is one of my favorite portable charger because it is from GP and it's very sleek and light. And then my iPhone cable with a very dirty Hello Kitty on it. Next we have a uh, tissue. <laughs> this is a Cheer Up Mini Wet Wipes tissue. And then I have more tissue. This is the Nipia. I have no idea if it's pronounced as Nipia, but it's a lotion tissue. And it's great for sensitive nose. So if your nose is like super sensitive and like will scab easily and it's super dry or like will grow rashes because you rub it too much, this is the perfect tissue for you. Yeah. The bad thing is that you don't really use it for other stuff because it breaks easily because it's so soft. And I like the picture of this baby seal. It reminds me of Bobby. Okay, next in my bag, I have my keys, and I don't think I, I don't think I've changed my, <laughs> I don't think I changed my pouch since the last video of what's in my bag. This is from Naraya, it's a Thailand brand. My keys, so I keep it in my pouch because if I throw it around in my bag, right, it will always scratch my wallet or like my phone and stuff. <sighs> That's like the sound of Bobby. <laughs> I used to have this like cute pouch which I put all the necessities I have so I can just take it and then shop in the bag that I use but because my bags have been like getting smaller and smaller so I can't really stuff the pouch inside anymore I just throw random stuff inside so yeah I'll just show you okay I'll have my lipstick of the day so whatever lipstick I'm using that day I will just bring it out throw it inside my bag this is from Fenty Beauty and it's Freckle Fiesta. It's the orange, burnt orange shade. And then next, I have this Studio Waterwick Mac Powder. I really like it because there is this like, you know, the highlighting area and then like the normal area. So I just mix them all and like touch up whenever I need. Next, I have the Vaseline Lip Therapy Rosy Lips. This is a slightly tinted um, lip balm. So a lot of you have been asking me where I got this like Vaseline lip balm. I actually got it when I was in Taiwan. But then you can get this in another packaging. I think it's like the normal Vaseline packaging but the mini miniature version in the Rosy Lips Therapy. Yeah, it's the same thing, different packaging. Next, we have my eye drop. This is um, from Rodo as well. Just not the Roto Lisse one, the pink one. I bought it when I was in Japan. I have like a ton of them lying around. So this is one of them that I bought. Nothing fancy about it. I don't really like, like, like it. 
it just works like a normal <laughs> eye drop. I like the Rodo Lise because it smells nice. It actually has this cooling sensation, but this is just a normal eye drop. Yeah, I got it because it was on the sale. <laughs> okay, the last thing I have in my bag is my wallet. It's empty now. I mean, there's sanitary pad at the side. <laughs> and this is my wallet. It's super shiny. So this is from Givenchy. But it's not from the female section, it's from the male section. But I really love long wallets, so I cannot work with those female long wallets because they are always so big. It's like they always come with the zip ones or like it's a super thick kind. I mean this is big but it's like sleek, so it's like slightly more compact than the normal female wallet. This is from Givenchy, I got it when I was in Paris again. And then I have my cards, my cash. Yeah, I have a lot of cards all over the place. Plasters. I always keep plasters in my wallet because it's so important. So along the side, I have my driving license, my debit cards, IC, Tang's membership, Chris Flyer member card, cash card, and Starbucks card. Oh, I also keep a picture of myself for some reason. I have no idea why. <laughs> so self-obsessed. This is actually a picture of me when I was like... 17 or 18, I was so cute. I mean, like, come on. So that is all for what's in my bag. I hope it didn't disappoint you because I haven't really changed much of my stuff. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching my video as always. If you have any other requests, please let me know in the comment section below and I'll get to it, I'll film it and I'll post it for you. So thank you so much for being here as always and I'll see you really, really soon.